So if these blood tests can be a good indication of potential cancer problems down the road, what other conditions can they uh, possibly predict you're on the path of? There are certain tests that we have that are called tumor markers. And those tumor markers, like say PSA in the prostate, uh, you can zero in on a tumor marker. Uh, sometimes, like if you run a CEA, that could be five or six different tumors. So one of the ways we can tell where that cancer might be would be uh, thermography. If you do thermography of the whole system, you can see the hot spots will be in red and the healthy spots will be in blue. And that could give a good indication of where that cancer would be. But guess what? There's a new kid on the block. It's, if you heard of the Holy Grail, <laughs> they named it Grail, G-R-A-I-L dot com. And it's brand new research that's going on where they figured out that the DNA would slough off something in the blood when a person had their first cancer cell, one cancer, I mean that early, the first very beginning of cancer, the DNA starts to slough off and there's a measurable component that can be measured in blood. So this is truly the whole future. Now people who are watching this video it's hard to believe what you want to do is go to your computer to G-R-A-I-L, grail, dot com. Now, when you look at that, you're going to see that they, just two months ago, the research has been presented to the International Oncology um, Seminar or forget how or where they presented it, but it's only two months ago that the research has been presented to the Oncology Foundation. And um, so can we go out and get the test? Not yet, but it's so hopeful, so interesting that this is going to be the whole future.